Hello, Lady Shins and perverts beating the Cyclops while other people are looking. Louis, are you going to do more speedruns? Always ready to do speedruns. Speedruns is amazing. There's no end to the fun that is had while doing speedruns. This is the most amazing experience to be had in this game. Wing! Fine pain. Immediate. Always so eager to find horrible pain. Look, it's after work, okay? It's after work, so you're going to get an even lower quality than you normally get. Usually, it's a, it's a solid 6 out of 10 on the quality of this commentary. You get some good hits, you got a lot of misses. Overall, it's just a mediocre time that everybody somewhat uh, enjoys and then moves on to their next activity. Today, I just came off work and I got out of work early, so I'm going to do some, some sweet, sweet recording. Well, that's not going to work out for me. All right, there you go. I don't know why I killed this man, honestly. That's what I told the police too, but... But uh, at least now, I don't have to answer for my misdeeds. I can simply move on to the next crime. It's, it's fantastic that being able, being able to get away with it, just all you got to do is just run. Which is also what I did, but <laughs> sons of bitches just caught me. So, oh, 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 bum there. We're going to get in there. Hey, Mr. Shopkeeper. Can't stop, won't stop, can't stop the beating that I'm going to give you. Stop him. I, I actually moved on. Instead of doing my incredible dancing on top of his head. Oh! Spike so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spikes up my ass. Spikes up my ass. Already resorting to poor singing. This does not bode well. Does not bode well for what is to come out of my mouth in the next 25 minutes or so. That I will endure the punishment. That Splunky loves to bestow upon my head because I have the terrible indecency of trying to beat it quickly. Well, that's not the weapon that I wanted. There you go. Alright, we'll just leave him behind. I'm just going to steal your shit, steal your grill, and leave you forever. He had bombs. I had to get them. There is no way I'm not going to get them. I have been noticing. Look, I don't usually listen back to what I record, and I have mentioned several times. One minute after it's out of my mouth, it's out of my mind forever. It will never come back. So... Oh, wow. Sometimes, though, I, I do listen back to some of the stuff to know what the hell I talked about so I can maybe pull a title out of my butt. Eee! Oh, it was trigger. <laughs> Panic for nothing. I'm going the wrong way. It's all right. We got some bombs out of it. That's really decent. A decent thing to grab. Unfortunately, got arrow in my butthole. It's all right. This this sh this uh, bomb's gonna do it. It didn't do it. I was trying to save myself a little bit of time. This run, unless we find a black market, is completely busted. So uh, I listen sometimes to the recording. To make sense of the things that I did? I don't know what that was. Like, I, I did not make sense of that one. And I noticed sometimes the audio clips is a little too loud. And I think that's because in my excitement, in my extreme zeal to deliver the most impactful commentary that I can possibly come up with, I get a little too close to the microphone. And I think I have misadjusted the level so that if I do that, there's going to be some distortion. So... Hopefully, you know, it's only been a mere seven years of talking to a microphone. I'll get the hang of it. I'll get the hang of it pretty soon. Don't worry about it. Uh, I guess we'll just go down this way, huh? Just remember that we have not murdered shopkeepers yet. Something that I need to, need to remind myself, apparently. Because it's just standard procedure to get rid of them. I guess I'm, I'm doing this, huh? Because I, I ain't going all the way around to find... What is this? What, what? I am salty, but <laughs> victorious. I'm salty or victorious. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> good plan, good plan. The, the spiders make it made it harder, but everything turned out according to plan. I don't care nothing about these shopkeepers. We may have. They cannot be stopped. Scum. When did I grab climbing gloves? <laughs> Could not tell you when that happened. What? When? Where were they? They picked them up from the shop. I didn't even realize it. Oh, boomerango. Boomerango. Uh, what's the worst that can happen? Just a few piranhas munching on my butt. Ooh. <laughs> you. <laughs> Just been trapped. Trapped forever. Between very sharp teeth and a complete maniac. I regret nothing. That mad talk. Should have saved my anus. Instead, I chose the wrong path. Just went down the wrong path, became a gangster instead of a policeman. Well, who could have thought that that tiny decision that I made would have had so many consequences? Eh, I guess we'll go around here. It's not my fault that all of these... Why did I jump so high? I am confused sometimes, okay? I'm just very confused. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, give me that teleporter, baby. We could have simply teleported down and left. But it's alright, this teleporter is going to make up for all the lost time. It's going to be a, the most incredible boon to my goals. Is that worth it? No. It ain't worth it. Eh. Made it happen, baby. I'm just good. I'm just, I'm just great. No, no, no. I am superb. Uh, what I do? <laughs> you know? You think I'm going to leave my teleporter behind? I'm going to do the thing where I go back for it. So that I can properly teleport into a mega spider. This is something that did not surprise me, but it still baffles me how if you teleport and immediately suffer damage, despite it being an arrow trap, which does not do you know instantaneous damage, it, it still has to travel to your face. But it counts and as instant instantaneous stun damage, so much so that the teleport stays behind. The arrow travels so damn fast that the damage that it caused retroactively left the teleporter way back there. So, the more you know. We have found this out before, but it was discussed in the comments. But uh, we never really had a, a very, very good example of it until just now. Where you, we can definitely say, yeah, that's exactly what happened. A little uh, mad <laughs> that we had to get through so much trouble here. Should be able to dig my way. You really, of course, of course that happened. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. It's only a matter of time until you piss him off anyway. Might as well embrace it. Might as well do it because I chipped a corner of their establishment. They are very particular about it because, you know, they have that security deposit. I didn't expect him to jump up. Yee! They have that security deposit, so they were like, holy crap, you're going to cost me the $650 that I had to deposit with that evil landlord who weirdly looks exactly like me. It's all a scam. All a scam. It's all right, it's all right, it's all right. We got this under control. Did not have it under control. The narrator followed up. At least we can just leave. <laughs> Is there a Ojedi in my inventory? I'm pretty sure no. No. That was a previous run that I threw away in some other way. The frog wasn't gonna get me. It wasn't gonna get me. I was ready for the frog. Really. I mean, you have so many bombs. You you should share them, comrade. I should share this bounty. <laughs> I wanted to avoid the climbing gloves, but this light barrage of lethal aggression made me reconsider. All right, we don't need no climbing gloves. We don't need anything but just <laughs> with this silly, silly tunnel. Don't murder me, sir. I am on your team. <laughs> he was the frog. Of course he was the frog. I'm on your team despite the complete lack of bald paint. 
an ornery disposition. I am a ball of sunshine wrapped in a Mexican package. A, a, a burrito happiness, if you like. A happiness burrito, if you want to alternate that. Of course, I did, you don't want to alternate it because it's Spanish. And the adjectives go after the noun. So I was being ethnic right there. I was just being ethnic. How dare you even suggest that I was just being idiotic? Good job, Adam. You're one strong individual. Strong, independent young man. Who don't need no Mexican to be saved. Well, we broke even and took forever to get to that level. On the bright side, I got nothing. This speedrun is already doomed. I don't know why I continue to hang on to it. What? Oh! <laughs> ah, is that it? No. Unfortunate. A slow minds can lead to very, very fast else. So, I'm not going to be too salty yet. I'm surviving so far. Why, is, why do you, you always have this amazing timing? It's like you always have to time that comedy in the exact manner that would contradict me at the absolute worst slash best moment. I don't know. It's a little conspiracy against me. It's all programmed in there. There's some listening devices, some alter artificial intelligence. Listening in to the words that I say, making sure that absolutely everything happens for maximum effect. What you have? A compass would be nice, but not worth all that time investment. We made it out with the old Jedi. Okay, this is it. This, this, this is the, the real deal. The old Jedi is going to point the way. All I need is for hell to open its gates to me. This is not going anywhere. <laughs> this was a terrible idea. At least I got some bombs out of it, but, you know, not the greatest time now. Not the greatest time. Ah, you just got nothing. You got nothing. Scum Lord, with those kind of wares, how are you going to make a living? All these lunkers that come across your path, they're just going to scoff at you. They're going to turn up their noses. I don't have money to buy. Can't stop the beating I'm going to give you, though. Sometimes it's corrupt, but I make it look like I was planning to to do exactly that all along. Believe me, that was nothing but pure incompetence. <laughs> I keep taking damage, I have climbing gloves. Why do I insist? It was just a measly compass. You can make one of those with a, a rod and a, and a pool of water and a little bit of magnet. Why well, you have to be so eager to do the murder. I don't know. I don't know, but maybe this one is it. Maybe this is the one. I do have that uh, sweet wood Jedi. That will point the way if I manage to come across the amazing. Really? I, I was about to say, this is weird. Please no. Please no. Okay. <laughs> I knew the man trap would save me. It was on my team all along. Yeah, I planted it there. <laughs> I planted it there. Five runs ago. You just didn't notice because I just have that kind of slate of hand. Just amazing that way. Oh, oh, no, no. I wanted to put down the shotgun and whip. The bomb. The bat ambushed me. It's nothing I could have done. Your honor. Nothing you can... Oh, that slipped out, my bad. Too many times in front of that grand jury. Too often. Get busted. Need to get better at all the uh, all the criminal misdeeds. Such as jaywalking and spitting on people that don't give consent. Can't help myself. I have a problem. I have already fulfilled step one through seven. Of the twelve-step problem, but but step number eight is giving me a lot of troubles. Step number eight, known, well known. Step number eight: ask, contact your family members, or tell them how much they mean to you. How do you do that? How do you do that when you already kill them all? It's, it's impossible. 
It is a little too try hard. A little too hard, try hard. Let's just bring it back. Ooh, <laughs> amazing, amazing Cobra save. Uh, bring it back to wholesome adventures in Spelunky, where the entirety of the screen tries to chase you down and murder you. I'm guilty of that. Sometimes I go a little too hard on something that in my head might end up being somewhat funny and it just lands catastrophically just the trip tripping a midget just collapse in front of the whole cafeteria of ghosts the food tray flying out of your hands and just splattering all over the place and splattering on top of your head the milk squashes right under your butt everything Goes to crap. Can you see? Can you see it? I don't see it. I'm very mad about it. I was trying. I was trying really hard. <laughs> Should have uh, disposed of that boomerang, man. I can't freaking see it. It has to be here, right? It is completely invisible. Completely invisible. Wish I had uh, given more credence to my instincts and figured it out. It's actually right there. We're going to do something like that, and that is kind of foolish. That's a little foolish. No, what the? I didn't anticipate that to be full damage. It is a non-standard non layout, so uh, you don't really. Know how to calculate the full damage there, so I'm going to give myself that excuse today. In that instance, don't worry, I have plenty of them. I am very, very good at the whole excuse issue. I am so full of them. Every situation has an excuse, every failure has someone else to blame. It's great to be this resourceful. At shifting my own responsibility. Very, very happy. Ooh. Stop the beating. I'm gonna give you. Alright, I don't know why I insisted so much on doing a lot of murder on that guy when all I needed to do was escape. Teleporting jetpack, though. This is going to be uh, amazing. It's going to be the greatest. You have never seen the likes of this escape. You thought that this guy would kill me, but no. We made it through that exit in five seconds. Five seconds flat. Not really flat, but you know. Ooh. Ah, just son of a... Mm, this, this one. This one stung. The others, whatever, man. Just throw them on... <laughs> just throw them on the pile. Alongside all my other failures. What is one more? I have a collection of thousands. That one, though... That was, that was a thing of beauty that got absolutely annihilated. So somebody sculpted a beautiful vase full of uh, nice patterns all around it and just, just beautiful contours with smooth, smooth surfaces. And Splunky was like, I'm just going to drive my fist through this beautiful vase and undo all of your pottery efforts. Oh man. I can't really get back out of here. I should have used the bomb because the exit is right there. Chest and key, that's all that matters. It's all right, it's all right. It's always a slow start. We get that big first run that goes places. We didn't get it this time around, but in general, that's the pattern. Why do you hate me? <laughs> Why do you hate me so? What did I ever do to you? I even picked the wrong side. I thought for sure that, that would be the side because uh, there was this stuff going on. That stuff with the powder keg. So I was like, of course it's not going to be there. They not consider that it could be right there in the corner. It's all right. I haven't lost yet. And you know what matters is we have that Ujira. We have that nice chance. I don't need help. I'm doing just fine. Um, nice chance. Of getting to hell. Finding that black market, all that good stuff. 
One of these days is going to be a successful attempt. One of these days is actually going to happen. Ooh, ooh, oh, oh. I would have seen that. Would have seen that easy. Feels like a total waste of time to get that Ojedi. Oh, All right, buddy. I just do. Oh well, grab the wrong power. <laughs> Run me. I grabbed the wrong thing. Never punish though. You guys see all of those freaking shotgun pellets going my way? Nothing stops me. <laughs> I just murder a uh, shopkeeper by action of a bomb dropping on his head. Oh man. Crunch a bitch. Are you out? We have bombs, but we don't have stickies though. What you got down there? Uh, I want that compass. I must have it. Just... It must happen. We got this in the control. Don't worry about it. It's just one minute. It's no big deal. We we don't worse than that. This teleporter though, I will use it, but I will regret it. Seems I have made you burst from the inside out, Mr. Shopkeeper. Oh no! My apologies for this not sanctioned interaction. <laughs> Look, I could have left him alone, but the boy was standing there looking all derpy like. I'm just going to obliterate him, okay? So, no judgment. We are in the ice caves. Huh, he was dead. In the ice cave, so, you know, suicide is, is a thing that needs to happen. And there is the suicide. Oh man, I lose the cape? I knew that I'd lose the jetpack because it freaking explodes. I didn't know I lost the cape. That's a new and exciting development. <laughs> we get, of course we get two grunks. It comes with a package of being reborn. <laughs> it just comes with a package. Gonna need to kill this mammoth so it doesn't freeze me to death. Uh, now that we are here, what's the worst that can happen? Just find the man's bald pate, stomp it, and go. The worst that can ha could have happened. I can't believe I have these two idiots in tow. Uh, the worst that could have happened. Oh no! It's alright. It's all good. Never punished for my idiotic indiscretions. Alright, alright. Slow your roll, buddy. Slow your roll. It is time. To find the Nubis, just not be foolish, okay? Please, reveal Nubis to me. Um, we got a, a really nice attempt going on. No! I wanted to go over to the other side, and I should have used a rope instead of being a retard. Why did I have to do that? I just was uh, really nervous about the crush trap. I wanted to push it to the other side. Maybe it would have killed Anubis. That one right there. Another one that stinks. Because I was doing great. It was a good time. It was a really good time. Whoa. And I wouldn't say it was a throw. It was a tough situation after I jumped over to the other side over the, the crush trap. But definitely a rope was the right call instead of trying to jump back. Instead of trying to jump back, a rope would have been the bee's knees. Instead, I just got stuck with the bear's butt. So, not happy about my performance there. A 20 second 1-1, one -one, but we got some bombs. Let's stick with it. Let's see what the shop has. If it's a garbage shop full of garbage items, I will not tolerate the insolence. I mean, it's not a garbage shop with garbage items. Also not exciting. I guess we're gonna simply walk to the exit, but... Stick with these bombs, they're going to be great. We got a whole bunch of bombs. What else can a Splunker ask for? <laughs> Thank you, Spider, for blocking that bit of poison that would have undoubtedly stopped me. In my tracks. Woo! Oh, there's a Nujai. 
key and chest right there. The, the key that you guys see it, that you spot it, it was there. You guys notice a lot more than I do because, you know, I am preoccupied with whatever is about to obliterate my anus. While you guys can just take the whole screen at once. Well, that goes my butt. Arrow traps, nothing, nothing much I could have done with that one other than, you know, scouting ahead. But scouting ahead is for cowards and fools. I am bold, I'm brave, and I will not be delayed. Hmm? Is that worth it? Is it 1-1? One one? What are you even doing? Ugh. Foolishness. Foolishness all around me. All around my brain. So damn stupid. Ugh. This is super garbage. Not to say that the seeds have been that bad. It's just me being garbage. It's, uh, I am bringing the garbage. It's not that the garbage is being given to me. The garbage is being brought by me. Let me just do a little bit of uh, casual beating here. Just very casual, very, very, oof. Very non-formal beating. And then just put a couple more bombs right under your butt and just watch yourself explode. Because for some reason you get into a situation where you're killing a shopkeeper for no indeterminate reason. It's just carry on forward with purpose. I am aimlessly throwing myself into the throes of darkness, into the nonsense scenarios and just time-wasting practices. This is inefficient. It is not virtuous and it is not heroic. Just idiotic. So let's just chill and recollect our vim. My vax muscles need to be relaxed. Unclench the puckered up octopus mouth and reassess your priorities. I am murdering too many shopkeepers. That is, you, you think that's a sentence that will never come out of my mouth. Murdering too many shopkeepers. It is just happening too much. But it's the truth. What do you want me to do? I want me to hide the truth from you? You're a YouTube viewer. You are a freaking truth lie detector. Truth slash lie detector. It's the same thing, isn't it? If you can detect lies, you can detect the truth. So don't get me, don't get me all twisted. This is making fun of me for saying the wrong thing. It is not the appropriate expression, but it's technically the same thing. A lie detector and a truth detector. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. So whatever. But anyway, what I'm getting at is killing too many shopkeepers. Doing it just because. You're missing the point of the exercise, which is you're going for speed runs. You're not going for revenge. This is not some petty vendetta that you got because this daily challenge got ruined by one of them. Disgusting individuals. No. This is the speed running comes first. And after that comes the shopkeeper murder. I was trying to hold on to the ledge there, but miscalculated that a little bit. And that was enough to do full damage. I think so far is a pretty good one. Let's see, 1 minute 20. Most of these levels are going pretty fast. Here's the time. Here's the time to, to do the murder. Oh, I'm glad that I held on to that. <laughs> I'm glad that that guy uh, was not me. Oh, there's an explosive frog. <laughs> that could have been pretty disastrous. It's very cool to get that compass before going to the ice caves. The thing is, though, um, I probably bought it. Could have probably bought that compass. I uh, was not keeping track of my money. We have 8,000. Probably could have afforded it. So, kind of silly. To have pissed off shopkeepers for no good reason. Again, them being murderous bastards is not good enough reason. I hate this. Oh, I miscalculated that. Thankfully, it was not too bad. Like, the miscalculation was not important what truly mattered was pissing him off so i could you know make my way around him but of course it would have been extra elegant uh, okay oh that happened <laughs> please leave <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that sucked. That sucked a million balls. What the freaking hell? What the hell? That scum lord. Eh! Got stuck in the worst way possible, and I was... <coughs> oh, jeez. Some... From the impression, from the terrible, terrible trauma. Spit went down the wrong pipe. Um, he got stuck in the wrong path, but I was like, oh, that's okay. I'm going to cook this bomb and throw it exactly where it needs to be. But no, he, I got a little too close. Because he was patrolling towards me. Ew. This fall damage is uh, the most pitiful fall damage. Oh, oh baby. It's all right, we can just teleport. Hey, I was going to be extremely pleased with myself. Teleporting twice into that man and then out of that man. That would have been awesome. That would have been beautiful, glorious, and etc, etc. But it was not meant to be. It's not meant to be. Take that little bit of extra time to get that extra bit of health. What a disastrous pile of speedruns. Can't even claim to my name a, an interesting... Spear, it's just been the lowest of the low. Many times there's so much failure, something we're, not, we're all used to, but there's a lot of uh, not even brilliance, just a lot of just foolish shenanigans happening. But not in this one, this one's just been it's just been misery and throws. It's just been the entire this is a video. T what? I was like, sweet, this is this shop looks good, let's go in there. The son of a bitch had planted a trap. It was all a trap for the greedy ass blinded by by the bling spelunker to fall into and I went straight into it. These damn dastardly sons of bitches got every trick up their sleeve and more. There's just nothing I can do but just fall into their damn stupid schemes for stupid people like myself. There's a chest over there. That's alright. Well. You win some, you fail some catastrophically. Something I'm used to. It's just the sting is a little bit tougher this time around. Just like Meredith said. I'm used to the feeling, it's just kinda just kinda stronger this time around. It's alright. I'm used to failure. Just gotta adapt a little bit to how much it stings this time. We'll come back to it. I am determined. I got nothing if I'm not determined. All of those women I've stalked, I always got the picture in the end. Whether they were laying still or struggling, I always got that picture. So, you know, in the end I'm going to get that worm. As they said, the early bird gets the worm. Well, the obsessive stalker gets them full of worms, if you know what I mean. I don't know where, where that went, but... Not any less truthful. Anyway. Let's just get out of here. Very convenient orange flog. Flog. I do not like them flogs. Uh, we have four bombs. Huh? I could have totally used a bomb to get through this nonsense instead of being this foolish. <laughs> Where's the exit? Oh, no! No! I could have easily used a bomb to get for all that stupidity, but it was the most winding. What is this start of this? What is going on? These arrow traps are out of control. The budget for these arrow traps needs to be reined in. There's just too much wastefulness. Some contractor over here got over budgeted one year, and then they just had to spend it all every damn time. Otherwise, they would stop getting the budget for the next year. So. That's what's going on right now. They just, oh, put, just, just put three more arrow traps there. We have to spend this money somehow. What, you want to get less funding next year? You just gotta do it. So that's what's going on. The, the eternal caves that are getting out of control is just full of corruption and just uh, all, all kinds of gerrymandering and just evil cronyism, nepotism, and buttholinism. It's all just debauchery all over the place. This is the exit. So we're going to find it, we're going to go through it, we're going to enjoy it. Maybe we can get a little bit more money to legitimately afford a, a compass, that would be great. Look, I can't leave you like this, I can't leave you like this, my flesh is boiling with shame. And acne 
and I can do something at least out of one of them. Wow! Well, let's try to. Let's try to do that. Let's get some proactive. Let's get some of that nice, sweet moisturizing lotion. Because I ain't getting rid of this shame. This shame is here to stay. It was there all along. You know what? I'm going to do it. Major Stupid deserves to be walked all the way to the exit. He is a good boy. We pat this good boy. Good boy, Major Stupid. A good boy. Just get out of here. Oh, man, we could maybe use that vampire flesh to our advantage. Just drape it over our shoulders. Like a cape. Or I guess we can also steal his cape. But I think it's way more fun if you just skin the vampire and use it as a flotation device. I guess, uh, you know, we're, it's, with all the nonsense going on, still a pretty damn great time going through these levels, if it keeps up. Making myself a little too hopeful here, but if it keeps up, we even go up this uh, vampire. Give me a sweet cape. Sweet deal, brother. Go to the ice caves. Haven't pissed off the shopkeepers. We have a cape going on. How will the mammoth get me? How will the mammoth get me? You know it's gonna get me. The question is, how badly will it get me? Could I even try for a maximum a maximum run but I don't have a, a hell I don't have a chance in hell to go to hell so just carry on you know what this is going amazing 1 minute 59 I guess it was a little slow at the beginning huh to uh, for it to be in a 1 minute 59 already we're using the cape there a little bit I'm just too excited to use it Yeti was ready to give me a knuckle sandwich, but thankfully I was just hopping and skipping to get out of its purview. Uh, uh, which side? This side. A little lucky there. Could have been either way. I don't think there was any indication that was one way or another, so just got a lucky guess. Uh, I guess, ah, uh, can't do it. I was going to just go down that way, but turns out the exit wasn't that way. I'm assuming it's... I'm hoping it's this way. It's not. I knew this was guarding it like the piece of garbage that he is. Trash. Dog man. I hate him. All right, brother. Holy crap. <laughs> that works out. It's all good. Let's remember. Oh! Okay, okay. We took some damage there. It was upsetting. Don't do it, you scum lord. Hmm. I was trying so hard to avoid all the hazards, but that bouncing crockman scumboat lore son of a bitch destroyed me. I can't leave. I can't leave like this. I can't leave like this. I must continue. I must carry on. Get me another sweet, sweet attempt. It's like crack. It's the freaking cocaine. I must do it. This arrow trap wasn't gonna get me. You absolute idiot. Yeah. You absolute idiot. I want to check that shop. Not worth uh, sticking to it. Because I already spent the bump in 1-1 one one and it was humiliating. But I figured, let's just stick with it. Maybe there's something good on that shop. It's nothing but shame. Please, <laughs> they call the ledges so I can go through the exit. Oh man, that croc man plus the arrow trap threw me. Too much. It was too much. Could not deal with both at the same time. If that, uh... If the arrow trap hadn't been there, I'm pretty certain I could have dealt with the crackman no problem, but two at once, I couldn't handle it. We were so close to uh, it. We were what was that? Four dash two. I was ready, man, to give all make my best. Oh, you piss off the shopkeepers. Oh, that's right. <coughs> I forgot. <laughs> I stole a freaking compass. One of these days, man. I think it's... Oh! Don't piss off the shopkeepers. Got all the way to the temple. Piss off the shopkeepers. Here I am. Cycling through the mines like a piece of trash that I am. I didn't mean to undo the cobweb. It's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to get around it. And then hold on to the ledge. Instead. Got freaking stuck forever. 
Let's see what the shop holds. If it exists. Yeah. Ooh. That was a waste of time, actually, now that I think about it. It's like, why are you even looking? Why are you even looking? Simply, all you do... Oh! Man, I could have gone for a key somewhere. Who knows where it was, right? Uh, all you need to do is come up to the shop and then rob it. You don't need to look first in that circumstance. That right, should be good. All right, well, we, we do have a jetpack, so it makes life that much easier. This is this the right way? Yeah, it is. I didn't expect it to be. Not expect it to be at all. What is the deal with the bats lately? They are just derping out every time. Not every time, but almost every single play session. Bats just derp out for no reason. I cannot tell you what the hell's going on with that. Uh, why the hell would the bats behave any differently? I don't know. That's not the exit down there, I don't think. It's going to be this side. There's no reason to do what I just did. Please, let me get through. <laughs> That's annoying as hell. <laughs> annoying as hell. One of the worst positions for a shopkeeper to be in. Because, uh, is that it? I don't think it is. It is. Eyes of an eagle, baby. I am just perceptive. Like my mother when she was searching for my room. Please descend so that I may forget about you. Okay. I was like, oh, is this going to be climbing gloves? I better make sure I don't get screwed. Got 21 bombs. How do you manage to avoid the double bomb drop? How dare you, sir. I hate this. At least we got one of them. Surely this guy's not going to come and uh, destroy me, right? I hate everything right now. <laughs> You know what? It was a pretty good black market, all things considered. I thought that I wasted a ton of time in the Ankh area, but it really wasn't that much of a waste of time. You know what? We have a hell run. We have a hell run. That's kind of changes the philosophy here. Let's hang on to this shotgun and just take it a little bit slower. There's no way it's going to take longer than nine minutes if I just go forward with a shotgun, taking it a little bit easy, right? A little bit uh, more cautious. So let's just take it easy like that. Don't mammoth me. Let's just give everything the time it deserves. I can't believe I went the wrong way. A little mad about it. I haven't restored my jetpack, so I think it, it matters to do something like this. Sucks that a nice game's level took 22 minutes. I mean, 22 seconds, but what are you going to do? My head? Let me get something out of this before exploding. All right. Come on, brother. This is your chance. This is your real deal. I can definitely guarantee you this is going to be the last run, no matter what happens. But maybe we can at least make it to the temple. Make it to Olmec. That will be, that'll be okay with me. Whew. It's a point of health and everything. Fantastic. So... Anubis, are you going to be my nemesis today? So often, it has been happening. That Anubis is just a complete disaster. For some reason, he just refuses to cooperate one way or another. Please give me an easy spawn and just murder the damn dog faced son of a bitch. Do we have spike shoes? I sure do. Uh, uh. I hate you so much. Come on, come on, come on. Get closer. What? <laughs> Will those two do it? Please do it. Nope. Oh, what a waste of time. Scepter goes into the lava, as I expected. Going to continue bombing down. Why, though? <laughs> oh, boy. I mean, we're still good. Still good. Like I said, you know what? How about you catch one of these? Um, like I said, the hell speed run time. It's nine minutes something. My personal best, that's it. Give me a good spawn. Oh, ho, ho. nice. One of the best spawns for a city of gold I've ever seen. 
Mm. All right, baby. You can get this done. So good. Take your time. You have two ropes only, huh? I was going to go that way, but then... But then... There was that terrible... Mummy. Terrible things happening. I missed this. <laughs> oh, please get ticket trapped. If you just don't give me a shopkeeper on top of it all that I cannot deal with. Alright, we got this. Alright, let's go to the top of Olmec's arena. We made it to Olmec, I am. I'm pleased with this. This is decent. You know what? This is a decent just time overall. I think it's, uh, what, 4.30 or something like that? That's, that's fine by me. Well, we're going to go to the top of Olmec. Uh, how did this guy catch? Oh! Go away from me! You little psycho! Well, at least he's dead. Take a little bit of time. Give me some bombs. Yeah, that's exactly what I needed. Excellent. Seven bombs. Uh, fine. Hell. Should be... We actually need to move this stupid ass piece of garbage into position. Go away! Alright. Uh, yeah. Come closer, Olmec. That was uh, a perfect cascading opportunity right there. Oh, don't mess it up. It was not. Why you do this to me? Why you do this to me? Eh, eh, what's that? Excuse me. <laughs> what? <laughs> I could have fixed it. I could have fixed it. It was bad, but I could have fixed it. But why did I get crushed? Completely away from all makes. You know, from from the wall where you you get crushed. I was, I was not supposed to be crushed there. I was on top. I was on top of the head. I'm telling you, man, shenanigans, shenanigans left and right. Wherever I look, wherever I do, Spelunky always comes out with the shenanigans to stop me. It's just the way that it does, and this must be reported to the authorities. This cannot stand. I'm going to write a very angry tweet. And I'm going to throw it at Derek U, and he's going to listen to my complaints. Listen. Listen, Derek U, I will type. Listen, you! You wonderful human being. Spelunky has been doing some shenanigans. Stop. Enter, enter. Lately, it seems, it's been getting kind of weird. Stop. Refer to this run for details link and then i trick dare you into listening to my der deranged things and then he becomes so enamored with me that we become best friends and then i will have a friend 